noise. But welcome back to my channel. Hi. Sorry that makes that noise. I have a little loose thing on my tub and I, I'm sorry. But if you're new here, my name is Gab and I had a long ass day today. So I'm like, why not go in my tub? Did I really just get a text as I'm starting my stream? Oh, it's from my bestie though. So it's all good. We're discussing ow we're discussing going to the beach holy shit that hurt anyways hello how are you um i figured we would just have a chill out fun bath sesh i brought my pepsi uh as always i'll show the suit of the day we have this top i actually think it's from victoria's secret i kind of love it it's very cute and then my bottoms are these i think these are really cute and they come up like really really high on the sides um they're a little teeny tiny big on me i want to find uh their bathing suit for the summer for this year so i gotta search and figure that out but hope everybody's doing well at a doctor's appointment today where basically um we talked about like underlying issues, things that have been going on for a while with me, um, so forth. Uh, I found out more information about things I have going on and some stuff they couldn't even answer those questions, so I have to wait to go to a different doctor, but I feel like I had a productive day there, but I had so many, like, needles I had to deal with today, I was not happy about that. I went to that doctor and I got B12 done in my arm which is supposed to help with like energy and stuff because I'm always just like feeling like I'm falling asleep and like I'm freaking who is that sleeping beauty the one who's always on her ass sleeping that's me and that's how I've been feeling so I got B12 done and then I was so annoyed because I like peed in a cup right and then after I peed in the cup you know which was like a lot I'm very proud of myself about that and uh, they were like looking for the script and they couldn't find it so they had to throw it away and I didn't get my blood done So then I went to a different blood lab and they had my script there for some reason it just came up in the system so I went and got my blood taken and I mean, there's no like mark or anything like there's like a little red mark. I think I had like five tubes done I hate getting my blood taken. I think it's just god-awful and like the girl I had was so freaking sweet and understanding that I was like losing my mind. She was so nice to me. And then I did another like, pee sample. And what did I do after that? Oh, I went to walk around. You guys know I love flea markets. So I went to a flea market and walked around and found like a doll for like a really reasonable price. Of course, and bought her because I love dolls. What else did I do? I picked up a package that I had from Shein for an upcoming video. Oh my god, the clothes like... I feel like I've been having great luck with them, and this round was, like, awful. I'm actually placing a, like, taking back order a, uh, why did I say taking back order? It's obviously not the right words. I'm placing a return because some of the stuff is just so cute, and then some of it was just so bad, and on my body, it just wasn't flattering. Um, I feel like some of them, it just wasn't flattering, and then other stuff, I didn't like the material, and then there were some items that I'm just like, uh, this would never fit me in a million years and that's an extra small. So I don't know what happened there, but oh well. Uh, I'm happy that I go through Shein, like I'm not mad or anything. And they have where you can actually get the money back or they could put it in like a virtual wallet for you on your account. So I just chose to do virtual wallet because um, like I mentioned, I want to go to the beach and um, I want to take some stuff with me. Thank you for the friend, uh, friends up. Oh my God. I want to read hi friend and I said thumbs up and friends at the same time. It was like thumbs up. Hi friend. How are you? That's my bestie. I love her. Um, I wish I could tighten this. I'm sorry that it's so annoying. It's probably irritating, but yeah. And then I came home and my headache shot, they forgot to send it to my house so it was like two weeks late so then I got my headache shot in my ass and it was like malfunctioning so like when it went in it burnt and I screamed fuck and it was very painful it was a terrible experience on me but uh yeah that was my day 
like I said. Oh, and I got a Hello Kitty ring too at the flea market. It was really cute. Lately, I'm thinking about possibly enrolling in college, which is really, really scary to me because if you don't know this, I have a long and short term memory loss I was born with. And um, to me, it's normal. It's like my everyday. But honestly, like it's hell. It's very difficult. And I learn completely different than like a normal person. So it's kind of frustrating. And um, I've always had some kind of like general learning plan going throughout school that like teachers would have to like follow, like gotta get extra time or whatever. So I'm trying to figure that out for college as well because I um, talked to my doctor about that today. And sometimes like for colleges, they'll have you get retested to see if it's really bad if you have like ADHD or whatever your issue you're struggling with. But because I was born with short and long-term memory loss and also I found out, um, I'll be talking about it in like a future video, but I found out stuff about my MRI, which was like good and bad. So like, I obviously have trace of like issues. So there's no reason I should have to pay for another test. Cause normally the tests run between a thousand to three thousand dollars. So it's like not a joking matter. It's so freaking expensive. So I have to like figure that out. I also want to figure out before the summer, um, I'm keeping my one dermal in my back. If you didn't know, I have dermals in my back. My other one, which I'm like playing with right now, has me losing my mind. Uh, the cap came off of it, so it's just kind of like annoyed and infected, and it doesn't feel very nice at all. So I have to try to, I didn't want to get it cut out, but I feel like I'm at the point where I have to get it cut out because um, it's just like really infected and annoyed and it's not going back to normal. And yeah, so I have to also figure out um, that whole process because I want to get that done before the summer and let it heal and stuff because like I mean I don't know like how long that takes to heal or what it looks like or anything so if I do get it taken out maybe I'll do like a video for you guys maybe I can even ask like if I can film when they're taking it out of my back that would kind of be cool I have a video on my channel of not me but a past friend of mine getting chest dermals like right here they ended up rejecting on them like two weeks later but i have like a video of like the piercer putting them in so i think it'd be cool to have a video of like somebody getting their dermals out on my you know channel i don't know i'm in the piercings but i'm not like i feel like because i'm getting older now that i'm really getting more into tattoos and piercings which is weird because piercings you can take them out you can let them close up I mean, sometimes you'll have a little bit of a hole, but like normally, you know, you can do that. Tattoos are forever. So I don't know my logic. My logic is obviously broken if you haven't met me before. Uh, but yeah, it's also my birthday in two weeks. My phlebotomist informed me of this today. I'm like, oh, I didn't know. <laughs> Cause I don't really want a birthday. I feel like if I really wanted to do something, like, I'd have to be the one person in my life to, like, hype it up and make it happen, and I don't know, and, like, um, my, uh, whatchamacallit, my family, we were gonna have something, possibly, because, like, everybody's vaccinated at this point, Doug has his last vaccine tomorrow, so it's, like, everybody, you know, is family safe or whatever the hell you want to call it, I've had my vaccine since how long now? I don't even know, when the hell would I get it? I think I got mine in March. Yeah, I definitely got mine in March, I believe. So, yay. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. I've been trying to look for work still. That's been a flop. Like I said, I've been kind of like looking in the schooling shit that's been, cause like I don't really want to do that either. <laughs> um, I kind of want to publish books. Like it's not even kind of, like I do want to publish books. Um. I just feel like maybe I have ADHD. I just feel like I'm always going in a million freaking directions. But I feel like I'm working on things that are like important to me as well. I'm working on embroidery stuff or I was painting something. Like, oh, thank you for the people who've been checking out my eBay as well. And for the people who have been buying my photo shoot pictures, I have photo shoot pictures available again on eBay, Depop. Or if you just hit me up on Instagram for PayPal. Uh, so I've been doing those. My one painting, I just sent an offer on tonight, which I was really excited about. It's hard being an artist because, you know, just selling art in general is difficult. 
And it's weird because I never know what's going to sell. Like, sometimes the weirdest shit sells. I'm just like, okay, whatever. That's cool. But, uh, I don't know. I just have, like, high hopes for the future. And I, like, obviously want to be successful. But it's difficult when I just don't know, like, what I'm doing. And I don't really think I want to go to school. And I kind of do know what I want to do. But, like, is it really logical? Like, and I just want to be a YouTuber and do YouTube. Like, that's not logical. Like, people do not become YouTubers anymore in 2021. Like, they just, it's just you don't make a career out of it, I feel like. So, maybe writing and publishing books? I don't know. I'm just blabbing right now. Um, I have like so much shit to do tomorrow. Are you single? I am not. I'm actually engaged. Um, I don't know how I'm getting married. Prices for weddings? Because obviously we had a pandemic we're in, so like everybody canceled shit and now people are rescheduling, so the people who should be getting married then are getting married later and it's just like a whole mess. So I planned nothing. Absolutely nothing. Uh. Those for the people who come here just to hear me burp and comment a million times. I see you. What do you want to go to college for? Um, so I narrowed it down basically. If I do go to college, I was looking at this MRI course, so I would just be doing people's MRIs. Um, so I was like looking at that and then, who the hell is this now? Oh, uh, freaking Twitch. Uh, MRI course or doing like writing courses. There's like one for like publishing writing, which I was saying like I'd love to like publish my poetry books. I feel like sometimes they're not grammarly correct how I'm saying it, but like it flows and sounds good to me. So I don't know. I thought about doing that. And sometimes I'm just like, I'd rather, to be honest, like, I feel like I should go to college and I feel like people in my life want me to. And some people just don't give a fuck about it. some people in my life do. But the thing is, like, I kind of just want to, like, find a company, which I've been trying to get hired at, or somebody's business and, like, work my way up. And then, I don't know, like, from there, just keep kind of doing what I'm doing online and my art and try to form a presence and maybe p try to publish a book even if it's on like Amazon or whatever I mean like because I've always wanted to publish a book so that's like one of my dreams so like I feel like if my friend Lexi <laughs> edits it for me and I'll give you like a free some money or something you know maybe put those up on Amazon. I think it's really difficult. That's the other thing though, to put up writing on Amazon. It's kind of tricky. Um, early because I feel like you have to have it in some kind of like special format. I know if you're like publishing online, um, for like an ebook and it's just like, that's so confusing to me. It's literally kind of like you're writing a different language, like computer science, like, you know what I mean? Like when people do that kind of shit. So I just, it's a little confusing. Somebody tracked their message. Damn, send a shout out to Brazilian organization, please. What is it called? Brazilian organization Commando Vermelho, please. I know I just butchered that, but I just tried to do my best job on that. So shout out to y'all. Y'all doing your best out there. And that's from my tub to your home. She can't cook. Don't bother. What do you mean? What do you mean she can't cook? Wait, are you talking about the person who asked if I was single? You're an ass, Lexi. They left then. They were like, she can't cook? I'm out. Whatever. Bitch. I know how to pick up the phone and call, like, a number to order pizza. Isn't that good enough for you? Isn't that good enough for you? <laughs> but, uh... Yeah, I think that's what I want to do. Also, I don't know. I've been trying to figure out what the hell I want to do for my birthday. Kind of want to go to this farmer's market and walk around and find antiques. The guy who took off his comment said he's looking for a girlfriend that can cook. Oh, yeah. that's. I'm glad he actually just dipped out. I'm sorry, dude, because... Yeah. <laughs> like, she's probably, like, dying at her keyboard right now laughing. I feel like I want to burp again, but I don't want to give this people satisfaction who like when I burp. I'm sorry. I just gave them one. No, I'm awful. I'm fucking awful. Uh, 
But yeah, so I think I'd want to go to that place that I like to go to, the farmer's market, and find some trinkets and some fun stuff, because I have like a flea market. And I think that... I think I should get inked. <laughs> There's somewhere I really want to go to get inked. I mean, it's like an hour or two from where I live, and I was like asking Doug, so maybe... I'll just beg him to drive me and I'll just use my own money and go. But we're going to the beach soon, so I don't know. I gotta save money for that too. So much shit I wanna do. So if you wanna donate to the Gabby Wants to Do Tattoo for a birthday cause, let me know. Check out my Depop and eBay. See with the one hand and view with the other, please. CV. Oh, why? Are you gonna screenshot it? Okay. I'll make it look good. Wait up, let me fix my hair. How do I? Oh, CV. I get it. Wait, okay. Wait, here, let me put my non existent boobs. Let me like rust them. We like. <laughs> do we like that? That actually kind of looks cute. That's actually kind of cute. This looks like a fucking peace sign. Like, peace. And I'm like cracking something at my shoulder. I was, oh. I'm like a broken little girl here. Broken little one. But, uh, yeah, there you go. There is your shout-out. Perfect. Awesome. How's everybody's night, though? I love sitting in a warm-ass tub. It's great. Very much of a fan. Gabby, they're a criminal organization. How am I supposed to know that? Is everybody laughing at me? How the fuck am I supposed to know? I don't know these things. Is that good or bad? And this is why I'm asking if I should go to fucking college or not. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I'm longer here, like, asking the hard-hitting questions. It's fucking hot in here. But I'm sitting in a hot tub. Hot tub. Maybe I could be a comedian. Do they have comedian schools? Yeah, that would be acting school, wouldn't it? Comedian school, acting school. That's like the same thing. I don't want to go to acting school though, because that's like memorizing lines of things that I won't remember, as we know. Also, my shoulder feels like it's going to tear off my soul of my body. Clown school. Dun, 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 dun. Oh my god, guess what I saw though on fucking TikTok the one day. I wanted to do it so bad until I realized you really have to have core muscle, which we obviously know my bitch ass does not have. Okay, so it's like this hoop, right? Their hands are like this, their whole feet go into it because they're like, then they like jump in it and they're like, literally this hoop is moving and this person's like, just like flying around in this fucking hoop and it looks amazing. It's freaking awesome. So I was like, I want to do this. And I looked into it and it's like $300 for this giant hoop to like have your size and everything. And it looks cool, but you know, I just, I don't got the funds. And also I don't think I have the upper cord to like make this wheel flip the fuck around and shit. But I mean, it looked like a cool idea, but no, I just don't think I have the momentum. That was funny. Don't take it seriously. Okay, I won't. So, yeah, I have a lot of videos coming. I bought a lot of stuff from the thrift, so please go to my eBay or Depop and check it out because I'm sending out packages tomorrow and I'd really appreciate it. I was actually gonna film a video tonight too, even though I'm like hella tired, but some stuff I need to send back to the company because it's too big on me and looks like shit. And now I'm sad. I hate waiting for refunds for companies. It's a pain in my ass, it feels like. But shout out to my friend who yelled at me about getting my ears pierced. Shout out to his family. Oh my god, it's so hot. I'm gonna say it like a million times. I wish I had water in here. I really brought that soda. My freaking dermal is like burning. Do you wanna see it? It's so bad. Look at my freaking dermal. Do you see that? Where it's like a red dot? That's like basically just like the metal top, which is like normal, but it's usually like puckering out of my 
skin and then you put like the little cute diamond on it like here i'll show you how it's supposed to look if you don't know and i feel like my whole freaking ass cheek is out so give me a minute i hate these because i feel like i wore these to the beach and i feel like a wave came and like my whole bop was just like sticking out and people children are just memorize what the fuck is happening you know so i can't worry to the beach again but um it's supposed to have like a cute little pink top on it like that uh it's kind of annoying because they're opals like real opals and i obviously paid money for them and then uh the opal that i had on it fell off somewhere and i had it off for a while until i had issues went in um the guy who was filling in put a new one on it wasn't tight enough and it fell off in my sleep. So I have the one that fell off in my sleep because it was in my bed, but like now I'm like, do I want to get it put back on or do I just want to cut out of my skin? Like what do I want to do? Wait, why is your face like that? Because of my back piercing. Yo, initially getting that done was hella painful, but I mean like, I think they look sweet as shit. But like I said, now I've moved on to tattoos. I'm just more obsessed with tattoos. And I really want another one, and I have some ideas. Like, I want it from a video game called um, Banjo Tooie. I want to get Banjo Tooie on my leg. Um, he's just like a cute little bear, and he has a knapsack with a bird in it. And they're just, they're just living their lives, you know. And that's why I want it on my leg. Um, if you didn't know, I, my whole sleeve on my leg is actually like incredibly meaningful things in my life um starter pokemon favorite disney princess bat for good luck for coronavirus a gumball machine on see obviously all super to my heart sentimental things you know crazy sentimental because that's just how i roll you know i have a big heart how many tattoos do you have uh, i don't know um should we count them I usually mess up. I think I have 14 or 15. Um, 14 or 15? Something like that. And I have my arm done. I want to add on to my arm. Maybe I'll do that for my birthday. Maybe I'll add on to my arm. I don't know, though. Honestly, the next time I wanted to add on to my arm was if I ever got to go back to Florida. Because all the freaking tattoo artists down there are so incredible. And I have a girl I'd love to go to and have her add to my arm. There's another girl in my area too I really wanted to go to to add to my arm. So maybe I'd go to her, but... Also, if you've seen Ink Master at all, uh, season... I feel like I have hiccups. 12. Um, there's a girl that's on her name, Alexis. She actually is local to my area, so I wouldn't mind going to her because she does amazing animal pics. I would love an animal tattoo. Like, give me a big old freaking pang win maybe on my own. I like penguins. I think they're adorable. Um, yeah, I have a lot of animal tattoos, though. I do have, though, like, an actual, like, sentimental tattoo. That is my sentimental tattoo. The rest is just, like, a shit show of fun because I'm fun. And then I have Barbie on my back as a tramp stamp because that was my first tattoo because... Why wouldn't you do that when you're 19 years old? I mean, come on now. Everybody has their first like mistake tattoo. I'm gonna have mine too. So, I have mine. Oh my gosh. I had such a long day. I'm actually kind of like so sleepy. And then I have to be up tomorrow and I have to go to the dispensary and they're so freaking expensive. And can I just say that they ripped me off when I went the other day and like, I'm still semi-pissed because, like, I wasted my money. Um, they don't charge that much more for a full gram than a half. If you don't know what I'm talking about, just think it as, like, milligrams of something. Like, get you rather have 10 than 5, you know what I mean? And I'm paying more money for it. So, they kind of, like, gypped me at this new one I went to. But tis is what it is, I guess. I'm still annoyed. I still hold that grudge in my heart because I'm an asshole. But, um, yeah. So, I have to figure I have to pay my fees on my card. And I wanted to look at another bathing suit for the summer. And yeah, so much fun stuff to do tomorrow, right? Just so much. And I have to get a package out, like I said. And uh, I wanted to review this package tonight. 
and that was the package I was gonna get out, but to be honest, like, I'm like, ugh. like, I feel like I wouldn't be able to be like, hey, let's all get clothes, but like, I might, I don't know. That's up in the air to me because, like I said, I had a long ass day. Ooh, what was that noise? I heard something. I don't know what it was. Anyways, um, yeah. So I think that's kind of remotely what I want for my birthday. Uh, I forget which birthday it was that I got my kneecap done. Something, I'm trying to remember. What year was that? You're a cute girl. Thank you. What year did I get my kneecap done? What birthday was that? Because I waited a year to get it colored because I'm a baby. I think it was my turning 27. I think it was my 24th birthday I got it done. But I honestly can't remember because uh, my brain is like mesh. It is just, it's just, you know, it's just blobbing out, chilling. Lexi, are you still in the chat? Did you leave? Lexi was like, hey, I'm gonna be busy tonight. That's what she texted me. And then she's like, hey, what's up? I'm just like, oh shit. Cause I was wondering where her bitch ass was. I missed her. She's a she's a good friend. She probably left. Says her name. She just comes right back in out of nowhere. She's like, hello. Um. But yeah, I think I want to keep my yeah. <laughs> she's your best friend. Yes, I've known her since I've been six years old. So yeah, I think that's somebody you would consider your best friend. I'm here. <laughs> Wait, how do you make you a moderator? Why are you not a moderator? There's gotta be a way, let me click on you. Okay, I don't know why it wasn't before. That's annoying. I know you are on TikTok though, but yeah, I've known her forever. And then my other best friend, Jenna, I've known since I've been in seventh grade. And then my other best friend I've known for three years now. I met her and she lives in my area. She's my bar friend. Hi, Irene, how are you? Welcome to the stream. Come on, Irene. I don't know the rest of the words. I like how the tough things like choo, 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 go on around. It went along with the song. It kept beat. <sighs> I really want to tighten it and I probably should because like I have the tools to do it. I just haven't. What does that say before I miss it? Message retracted, message retracted. Okay, so I can't read it. Hopefully the screen scrolls down though because I just got my hands wet. Yeah, it does. Hi, hi, how are you? How's your day going? I can't believe tomorrow's Friday already. Where the hell did this week go? freaking bypassed us all um I think tonight maybe I won't film I think I'm gonna take eBay pictures only because when you see the haul that I have coming up I got so much more that I want to like put up for sale and stuff and then I got some stuff for myself and yeah oh my god all I know is like my collection from how it used to be to like everything I bought now is going to be a shit show. It's going to be ridiculous because um, there's just a lot of it. I feel like some of it I might get rid of, like not all of it obviously, but like parts I might, but who knows because I love collecting my stuff that I enjoy. It's just a part of me. Here, I'll get that out of the frame. Hi gamer, it's Carwin. How are you? I hope I said that right. I'm not sure if I did. And I'm sorry that I'm like glaring you guys out with my glasses, but hello, how are you? Welcome to the stream. We are just chilling out, babbling, talking about this and that and everything in between. Um, yeah, it's me, CJ. You said it right. Oh, how are you? Did you make a new account and change your name? Nice. How are you doing? Just out of curiosity, why are you in the bathtub? So apparently this is like a new trend on Twitch, but people are taking like blow up pools and putting them in their living rooms, in their computer rooms, which would scare the shit out of me having a whole tub of water um, near my computer and outlets. 
but this is a thing people are fucking doing now. And obviously my bitch ass, I am living out of two rooms right now um, with two people in them, me and my fiance. And I'm not gonna fill up a tub with water and then something bad happens to my said belongings. So I was like, oh my God, I'm gonna go in my hot, there's hot water in here and I'm in the tub, get it? So it's my hot tub. So it is my hot tub stream. Also, I don't realize, I don't, well I do, I don't think you guys realize how much time I actually spend in the tub because of my condition. The, like warm water really helps it, it feels nice. Today, I had the worst excruciating pain in my foot. Um, it was like here to here. I don't know why. I was like losing my mind and I could like barely walk. I just relied on my cane most of the day. So I don't know. It's nice to just have a soak. It's 10 46 AM. Uh, I don't know what time it is here. It might be like nine something. Oh wait, I can see it when your thing comes up. Let me look. It's 10 46 PM here. Hmm. In interesting but yes i feel like i had a productive day i feel like i had a productive day the other day too i got like a shit ton of wash done um i filmed some videos i edited some stuff but the other day like we both fell asleep at eight o'clock at night and i woke up at like one randomly and then went to back to bed and then woke up again at like 8 a.m i was like what the freaking uh, i was so pissed I mean, we slept for like way too long and that's why I was mad, but like, I don't know. It's just weird. That's why I got a B12 shot today. I just keep oversleeping. I didn't know about your condition. It's my first time here. Oh, well, welcome. I, um, if you want to like look back on my channel, if you ever like want to find a video of mine, you can put in like art, uh, slash like Gabriel Regina on YouTube. My videos will come up, but basically I have a uh, fibromyalgia and possible i'm in the process of being tested and treated for lupus um see if i have it and yeah it's basically if you don't know what fibromyalgia is it's a like nerve disorder and it like it goes into your muscles and joints kind of like arthritis and it's extremely painful and it makes like other parts of my body act up hence why i'm so thin and um yeah it's kind of shitty but it's okay i deal with it and like I had mentioned before, um, in the beginning of the stream, I was born with a long and short-term memory loss, but I'm kind of just used to that because like, that's just how I was born. And something that I just kind of like came with one day, it's a package deal. <laughs> I came out and that was my Pokemon special attack. So much fun. I want another Pokemon tattoo so bad. I think I want Squirtle or something. He's like super duper cute, but I'm not sure. All I know is I would love to add on to my arm for my birthday. Maybe if I got somebody from this area and they did like really decent work, then yeah, I probably would want to. Yes, hello, there's a smiley face, yay. <laughs> Do you guys love like my background of all like my shampoos and shit? This freaking ultra gentle hydrating cleanser by Neutrogena, let me tell you, it's not hydrating my ass. It's not gentle my ass. It freaking burns your skin out and makes you feel like shit. So, uh, I do not recommend that. I do not give that like a 10 10 recommendation. Um, yeah, do not purchase it. It burns your skin out. Face wash recommendations, I would say Aveeno. Um, I use this like St. Ives one. Oh, what is the other one? I have like one over there and it's kind of like a clay mask. I forget who it's by, but I feel like it really like dries up some of like the imperfections and like marks on my skin sometimes that I get. So I have inflammation, inflammation, what the f inflam inflammatory acne holy shit which is basically just like hormonal acne because i can't take birth control oh my god i don't really get in like one spot i don't know why i said it's so stupid my brain just like farted out and i don't want to stretch my legs but yeah i feel like i just want more tattoos like look at this like yes i love how they look when they're wet and they're like warm they just like pop out more Yes. I feel like I need more on this side though because I hate that gap. 
like I don't know where I think I'm probably just gonna build off of like right in here like in the front in there I just don't know what I want like I have ideas but like I said like I'm a sucker for people's flash to be honest like I love a good flash I didn't know those things but yeah but I'm glad you're okay hugs from Brazil thank you and yeah no it's all good like I said I have some videos about it on my channel and um I've known for like three or four years now and I don't know every day it's just like something new and basically I can't just like I can't just let it consume me so I just kind of do what I can every day and you know and that's all I can do basically and that's why I have a lot of tattoos because with my condition sometimes I just like go numb like if there's too much pressure on a certain point of my body it kind of just goes out so when somebody has like a tattoo needle drilling into my skin it just goes out and it's kind of nice because I can kind of relax and I'm not in like horrific pain um I will say that's not for the kneecap and like this area kind of was like hard for me I don't know why it was like a little painful but I know they have like numbing topicals and creams and shit which I never really looked into I did for the back of my knee I used a numbing thing but I never did for like anything else I don't know I just some parts are easier than others I really thought this part was gonna be bad because it's like the back of my arm and it's like a pinchy area and it didn't really phase me um I <laughs> oh my god I feel like I sound insane saying this I've had dreams of getting my armpit tattooed <laughs> because I saw this one episode of Ink Master. I definitely brought this up on a stream before. Like I'm so if I'm repeating myself, I apologize, but I know I have because I'm there's an Ink Master where it was like a playing cards of like kings and queens or something stupid like that. And this lady's like, I want or I think it was a guy or a girl, I can't remember like if it what gender they were, but they were like, I want a um playing card in my arm. Uh, of like a deck of playing cards or something like that or the one I forget which playing card they wanted and they did a fucking playing card in both of their armpits and like one and then the other and like I don't obviously want a playing card in my armpit but I was like holy shit they got their armpit and like it was obviously Ink Master so it was a detailed ass tattoo so I wouldn't even get like a detailed ass tattoo but I kind of want my armpit like bots would it really be that bad <laughs> I hate the new Among Us. You can't chat anymore. Why? Because people are being dumbasses. That's why. What kind of tattoos are you planning to do next time? Anything in mind? Um, I have like a Pinterest, like not a board, but I have like a list on my phone and like things and ideas that I've thought of before. CJ, you know I'm right. You've seen what I posted, my freaking like let's plays of them and the shit that people say and sometimes stuff I have to like take out. Like it was just ridiculous. Like. And obviously there's like younger people, like kids playing and shit. And now that's not as popular anymore, they need to keep people playing it. So I could see that, but that's, that's really funny. Um, so yeah, I have some ideas of tattoos in the future of what I want to get. Um, obviously cause my memory is shit. I can't like tell you right off the bat, like what I want at the moment. Um, but all I know is, like I said, I think this area, like right here, and the front needs to get done with something like longer maybe to throw in there like i said i'm very like a flash person so like if i see something else on the splash you'll be like oh i want that um i know this tattoo needs to get fixed it has some like issues and the person i went to is just switching shops so i need to contact her when she's more settled about fixing it and getting the color retouched and still some parts of it are really deep into my skin healing still because i have a lot of healing issues with my immune system so it's I'm just like letting it go take its time obviously too I don't get tattooed in the summer last year with COVID was an exception because of like how everything was going and I couldn't I had actually tattoos planned like the the week that the world like shut down or whatever I had a tattoo the next week after <laughs> that obviously got pushed and I was so freaking pissed um so yeah I forgot what I was getting done that time I don't know if it was my link. I can't even put my leg up. I'm sorry. I'm just like tired. Uh, I don't know if it was my little link that I was getting done. I don't know what the hell it was anymore, but uh, I have like some ideas. That's why I'm like, I want something for sure for my birthday, but like, 
I don't know if I just want to look at people's flash or like if I just want to go with like some kind of idea and they do it. I'm not really sure. Yeah, I don't know. I just know I want to like look at people, maybe a local, maybe an hour or two out, but I'm trying to think. I'm really trying to use my brain right now. I'm like, what did I have in mind? I know I wanted to make this blend more. I know in the future I want a carousel horse up on my legs. I have tickets right here. It's like there. Um, I had the idea of like doing like at the fair those like dragon rides that they usually have where you can like sit in it and it like spins and having maybe like Hello Kitty in it. I wanted a Hello Kitty popcorn machine at one time to go by my fair. I think I'm more concerned about the octopus getting fixed because it's a little bit dark and muddy and I kind of just, I don't even know how she would make it brighter, but I just would like it to pop more and I feel like it doesn't, I don't know. But in regards to that, yeah, I feel like I just kind of want something more over here. Um, yeah, I just, I love flash. I love people's flash books so much. I wish people in my area did more of it. Armpit could be cool, but probably won't last. Mm, debatable, early, and I'm really saying debatable because I don't sweat a lot. And not to be gross, guys, but I wear deodorant, but, like, I don't sweat. If I'm being real, if I'm just, like, putting it down during my, like, period, I sweat really bad. Like, I have, obviously, like, issues. It's rough for me. That's the only time I really sweat. Sometimes if it's hot in the summer, but I don't sweat a lot. Like, I don't have crazy sweat guns. So, I feel like maybe the armpit wouldn't be god-awful. Like, it would be sucky. Like, oh my fucking god, I'd go for an outline and I'd get the hell out of there. You know what I mean? And go in again for, like, the color, but... I don't know. I don't even know what the hell I'd get in my armpit. I just... I... The kneecap, though. Can I just tell you the kneecap? I never thought I was going to get my kneecap tattooed, and I did. And can I tell you so many people on TikTok are, like, the red part of, like, little flower thing. They're like, is your knee bleeding? I'm like, no, it's a tattoo. I wish it was colored in more red. I think eventually I might have, like, the whole thing maybe colored in red. Like, I'm okay with how it's shaded, but it kind of does look like I have a skid knee, and it was bleeding. Um... But that's okay. I pick apart my own tattoos all the time. I'm just that type of person. I'm just, you know, I'm like, eh, don't like it. Love it. All I know is I would love to go back to Florida again. And, like, I wouldn't mind going to Disney and stuff, even though it was like, how did my earring come out? Are you kidding me? When the hell did I lose that? I lost my earring today, guys. What the hell? I just fell and I was like, where the hell did it go? All right, cool. Anyways, that's just like threw my train of thought off so bad just now. So I was like, where did my earring go? I don't even know what I was going to say. Oh, if I go back to Florida, there's two different tattoo artists I'd really want to go to. And I feel like I'd have to have so much money saved just so I can, like, pay for both of them. I would totally do back-to-back. -back. Go to one person one day and then the other the next. And, like, the ironic part is they're very, very close friends. They used to work at the same shop. Because the one girl did this one for me. Her name's Sammy. She's so freaking talented. I love her. I have a video about that tattoo on my channel if you want to check it out. But then um, she has a friend down there too, and she does more stuff that's like kind of what this tattoo looks like um, for the style. Am I even putting my arm well for you? I feel like I'm not, but I'm sorry, I'm exhausted. <laughs> so I'm just kind of like bending it around stupidly. I saw when it fell. Can you sing? I like your voice. I feel like I can sing. Um, I have. I feel like I just keep being like, hey, look at this old video of me. But I also have, like, videos of when I, like, used to perform on my channel, too, of me singing. So, if you want to hear my voice, you can check that out. Thank you, everybody, for thumbsing uh, my video up. My tub's still warm, but it could be warmer, I feel like. 
so much warmer. It's such a freaking bad headache all day in like the same freaking spot of my head. It's so annoying. Hate it. Oh my gosh, it was just, I feel like I had such a long day. Just like driving here and then there and then here and then there and I'm just like, uh, I got a shot, you know, for energy and did it help? Do I have energy? No, I feel like I don't. Yo, you nice girl. Thanks. Is it because I'm in a tub? If it's nice, thumbs it up. You just see it go up. It's like, boink. Thumbs up. But yeah, I'm so beat. I had a long day. I feel like I should be like cleaning up right now and I'm just like, Hi it went up, let's go. <laughs> I feel like I'm just like hiding out in here. I'm just like, hi, I'm hiding out, don't come find me. But, yeah. Lexi, why'd you say you were busy tonight, but you obviously aren't? That was pretty fake of you. I feel like I kind of hate my octopus though, like slightly. I just like, I picked the placement out, but now looking at it, I'm like, I don't like the placement. <laughs> oh God. Like I love how the side looks and then I look over here and I'm just kind of like annoyed. Maybe I just need something small here or there. I don't know. I just, I get annoyed with myself with the stupidest shit. I also, like, don't really like the background, and I think that's what kills me with it. I was busy most of the night. It's 11 p.m. It's go I'm going to bed soon. Why did I think it said it's going to bed soon? Those are cool, like, tattoos. Thank you. Yeah, I was discussing before how... I don't know if I... <laughs> Just, like, I feel like my dad... I was discussing before how I want to get this part like filled in and I feel like the only reason why I'm like iffy about this one is because like there's a background with it and I wasn't sure if I wanted a background I didn't know I was getting a background and like as you can see none of my others have backgrounds so like um I don't know I feel like maybe if I had another one with like a background it would like even it out possibly who knows? Lexi, I was obviously joking. Do you know that? Lexi? Do you know I was joking? I didn't realize it was 11 already. Did anybody else realize it was already 11? I didn't find your singing videos. What did you put in? If you... No, I'm telling you, you can easily find them. If you go under playlists... I know. If you go, can't even do this. If you go, do you see what I'm doing with my arm? If you go under playlists and click, shit, what is it? What do I have it under? I think I have it under like performing videos or something in that order. I have it under. Do you see my arm going? Okay, I think I'm getting off because. <laughs> I'm just sitting here like fucking rubbing my arm against this and messing around, not being serious, slopping my freaking wet ass hair off of my, um, trying to decide if I actually want to film my little clothes haul tonight. I'm on Shein again. I'll be texting your ass. Well, I, I wanted to show you what I was going to get with my refund money. Um... I feel like maybe I, I do have some energy. Maybe I will film that video. Make myself real tired. I'll film my clothes video. I don't know. It's very debatable right now. It's very up in the air. Cause I'm like, do I really want to do that right now? Cause I can always do it tomorrow when I get home. You guys won't be seeing that video for a little bit. I have another one before it. Yeah. Okay. Um, I think I'm gonna go on Shein and look at stuff. And 
and I should probably wash my hair because it's slightly greasy at the top because I haven't done it. Not because I'm a gross ass bitch. I think I'm gonna get more shit for Hot Girl Summer. It is Hot Girl Summer 21. I, I wasn't gonna say anything, but guys, today my uh, fiance's, his Australian Shepherd got a kick ass haircut for Hot Girls and Boys Summer. So, I mean, I think y'all should be getting your clothes, getting your titties out, getting your tatties before it's hot girl summer because you know it's hot, you don't want to be unresponsible. My tattoo artist has told me horror stories how people get tattoos and she's like telling them like it's her first time she's giving care instructions. And then they're like, thank you so much. And they're like, oh my God, I can't wait to show this off at the beach next week. See you. And she's just like... If you didn't know when you have a fresh tattoo, you shouldn't be going in the sun because you're going to fucking ruin it. And that's so ignorant and dumb and like, just like, why are you paying X amount of dollars for it then? Don't waste your money. Anyways, okay, I could just go into like a spiel of that and I'm not going to. I love you guys very much and uh, I will see you all tomorrow in my next video. So look forward to it because it's coming at you. Alright, so I love you. And if you guys like this, please thumbs it up. Let me know in the comments down below that you want to see another um, hot tub with Gab. And until next time. Da -da -da -da. <laughs> no, okay. I'm getting off. Okay, bye.